Hi, I'm Dr. Julie, and today we are going over foam rolling for your thoracic spine. This is part of the three-part warm-up series that all my patients do before they get adjusted. And if you're doing a corrective care posture program at home, you want to pick up one of these from Amazon, Target, Walmart, any sporting goods store might have them. So this particular one is really hard, really dense. It does not have any give to it, okay? Very, very minimal. It's a dense, dense foam. You don't want it pool noodle flimsy, and you don't want it hard rubber spiky either. Okay, so this is a really good one for me. I like the longer one just because it's more versatile. You can do more with it, um, but it doesn't really matter for purposes of doing the thoracic roll. It could be about half that size. Okay, so we're gonna start on the ground. We're gonna do this for three times minimum, okay? Um, up and down the spine. The first time you do it, you're in a neutral position. The second time you're gonna be twisting. The third time you're gonna be side bending, okay? So rules are keep your feet underneath your knees. Don't let your legs straighten out. And you're gonna do little small movements with your legs. Okay, you're using your feet to go back and forth straight, a little bit of bend, bend and flex, okay? So you're gonna start in your lower ribs. This does not go into your lower back. If you don't have ribs there, it doesn't go there, okay? So feet underneath my knees. I'm gonna bridge up my butt, look straight up at the ceiling. Do not get tempted to do this because it puts a little um, exercise on the neck muscles. So it might be hard to hold the head up. You can take as many breaks as you want, okay? But don't do this. Okay, give yourself a big hug, look straight up, <clears throat> and you're gonna walk up and down. So see what I'm doing with my legs? Tiny movements, and I'm not reaching all the way up towards my spine yet. I'm just going up and down where it's at, okay? Now I'm gonna walk a little further to let it go up the spine a little more. Small up and down movement, small. Then walk a little bit more and it's now up in my upper back, okay? You might need to lift the butt a little higher to get that upper back, okay? Now I'm gonna to walk towards myself. Small up and down movements. Plant those feet, up and down. Plant the feet, up and down. Plant the feet, up and down. And then sit up, take a rest. Okay, you don't need to take a rest, but uh, if you're, if you're just starting, you might need to, okay? Because the neck might be a little tight, that's normal. Um, so the next exercise is, tw is twisting, okay? I'm gonna bring it back down here. Start in my lower ribs, not in the lower back. Lift up, hold my elbows. Twist, look the way you're twisting. Go up and down, small movements, up and down. And then walk that way only. I'm only walking in one direction. Keep the spine on the roll. Just let the shoulder blade off. Now I'm gonna reverse. Walk toward me. Okay, that's rotation. The third and final time, time I'm gonna bring it back down. I'm gonna do side bending. Okay, big hug again. Look straight up at the ceiling. Side bend, up and down, small movement. Other side, then walk that way toward the wall in front of me. Until I reach the top of the spine, and then reverse. Keep the feet underneath the knees, breathing. I am not holding my breath. And that is it, thank you.